everybody, lots going on this weekend on this edition of Weekend at the Lake. We're of course brought to you by Serdak Yamaha, NHC Healthcare Center in Osage Beach, SRG Financial Advisors, and the Mile Marker Formula. Back with the stories after this from Serdak Yamaha. Now is the perfect time to prepare for summer at the lake, and Serdike Yamaha is the place to go. From boats and wave runners to motorcycles and ATVs, Serdike Yamaha has something for everyone. Serdike Yamaha is family owned and operated, and proudly celebrating over 50 years of serving the Midwest. At Serdike Yamaha, you'll find more than just great products. We're a full service operation, ready to provide all the parts, accessories, and services you need for a great time outdoors. Visit Serdike Yamaha, your one stop shop for year round fun at the Lake of the Ozarks. Okay, the 71st Annual Dogwood Festival is this Thursday through Saturday in Camdenton. There are going to be a carnival, garage sales, melodrama, <laughs> food, arts and craft booths, live entertainment, dinner, theater, parade, and more, and Lake TV. Going to be bringing you live parade coverage Saturday, April 23rd, beginning at 10 a.m. For the full schedule of events, go to camdentonchamber.com. And the lake's largest and longest running boat show is just around the corner. Lake of the Ozarks Marine Dealers Association's Spring in Water Boat Show is Friday through Sunday at Dog Days Bar and Grill. Numerous lake area marinas will be on hand with everything from personal watercraft, runabouts, pontoons, performance boats, cruisers, and then big yachts. You'll also find accessories, docks, lifts, and a lot more. And the Lake Ray Spring Flinging Tasting Event and Fundraiser is Friday from 5 to 9 at the Encore Lakeside Grill and Sky Bar. The event is sponsored by Hy-Vee and features appetizers, dips, beer, wine, and spirits. Tickets are 25 bucks. Proceeds benefit citizens against domestic violence. For more information, go to lakerace.com. The Crossover Music Festival presents Sporting Clay Fundraiser. This fundraiser is to promote direction and hope to the homeless teens here at the lake. It's a $100 donation that includes lunch and shells with lunar shotguns available. Lunch is sponsored by The Butcher Shop. This event is Saturday with two different shoot times. Going to be at the Missouri Trap Shooters Association. Get all the details at crossovermusicfestival.com. And Lake of the Ozark Spring Big Bass Bash is Saturday and Sunday at 6.30. You can still register in person Friday at PB2 from noon to 7 or on Saturday or Sunday at the all weigh-in stations starting at 5.30 a.m. Entry fee is uh, buck forty for one day, one ninety for two. You could win a new Phoenix bass boat and the Big Bass wins $100,000 for all the details and rules go to MidwestFishTournaments.com. The Civil Air Patrol, what's that? The Magic Dragon Street Meet and Shootout News. All that and more from SRG Financial Advisors and the Mile Marker Formula. While the financial services industry for years has focused on products, pricing, and performance, or things we refer to at SRG as the how, our focus for our clients has always been around their why. And without fail, over all these years, those whys have centered around family, occupation, and recreation. Think legacy issues, retirement, or achieving a work optional lifestyle, and checking off those important things on that recreational bucket list. Our foundational approach remains a focus on the things that matter most to our clients and the things that together we can control. And where those two things overlap, that's where we live and work every day. That's SRG Financial and the Mile Marker Formula. Hey, have you ever wanted to see what the Civil Air Patrol is all about? You'll have the opportunity to do just that this Monday. The local Civil Air Patrol is hosting an open house at Sacred Heart Catholic Church. It's up in Eldon at 6 p.m. Civil Air Patrol has three missions, cadet programs, emergency services, and, of course, aviation. 34th Annual Magic Dragon Street Meet Nationals is May 5th through the 8th on the Bagnell Dam Strip. Unique show for all makes, models, and years of show vehicles, trucks, and motorcycles. The Strip, by the way, will be closed to normal traffic during show hours. Get all the details at magicdragoncarshow.com. All right. Lake of the Ozarks shootout events are starting a little early this year with the 14th Annual Shootout Benefit Golf Tournament. It's Friday, May 6th at Lake Valley Golf. Lunch is at noon, and it's going to be a shotgun at 9 a.m., 125 bucks a player. That includes 18 holes, a cart, and lunch. There will also be awards handed out, and as always, this event benefits local charities. Go to lakeoftheozarkshootout.com 
for all the details. <laughs> this week on Community Spotlight, Chris is joined by Tyler Loftus of Ozark Homes. Well, watch Community Spotlight here on Lake TV every day at 9 a.m., 3 p.m., and 7 p.m. On Cup of Coffee, Uncle Chris is back with Wild Will. This week they discuss Alderman Klotzer's plea over Mayor Newbury's ethics violation, the lawsuit filed by Bethany Bowen against Sheriff Tony Helms and Christopher Twitchell and more. Catch a cup of coffee with Will and Chris from Slumberland Furniture every day at 8 a.m., 1 p.m., and 8 p.m., right here on Lake TV. And if you're a fan of the Beverly Hillbillies, Petticoat Junction, Dirty Rotten Scoundrels, and other Paul Henning works, you're going to love this weekend's edition of On the Trail with local historian Bill Mulder. On What's Burning with Kevin K.B. Burns, watch What's Burning daily on Lake TV at 7 a.m., 5 p.m., and 11 p.m. That's it. Kind of a full weekend going on, right? See you next time.